so today we're going to be doing a gender prediction test um, and with Old Wives Tales. I have Riley here. Can you say hi? Hi. Hi. Um, I am 18 weeks along, so in two weeks now we'll be going to an, ultra, an actual ultrasound to find out the real gender, so it's just for fun, obviously. Um, I wanted to do the baking soda test and the cabbage one, but the cabbage is like way too expensive for me to waste like $5 on just to pee on it. So we're only going to be doing the baking soda one. And then I also have a list of um, gender predictions from old wives tales that um, I found that are relevant. Some of them aren't relevant, like um, are you carrying high or low because I'm not far enough to know that yet. Um, so this is a list of ones that are relevant. and. Riley also said that we could use her etch a sketch pad to keep track of whether or not um, whoever gets the most tally marks for either boy or girl. So I'm gonna go pee so that we can start on the baking soda first. Okay, so I went pee and I I didn't drink a lot to do this and I've kind of waited. I only went pee in the morning, so it's kind of really concentrated. So it's kind of gross. Um, but I have baking soda and I have pee and I read a couple different ones. Some of them said he used. Um, two tablespoons and then another one said equal parts and another one said it doesn't really matter so I just went with it doesn't really matter so if um, it says if it fizzes like crazy it's a boy if it stays relatively fat flat then it's a girl Riley do you want to pour it yeah okay you're gonna pour it in there yeah okay ah. okay pour It didn't really fizz. Put the rest of that in there. It's crisis. Is it fizzing? Yeah. What do you think? What do we think it's now? I don't know. The last little bit that we put in there kind of made it fizz a little bit, but I think it stayed relatively flat. So, is that a, is that one for the girl? Yeah. Yeah? You think so? Yeah. All right. We'll draw a little heart for the girl. Okay, me. Let me do it. Oh, I already drew one. Okay, we got, we got one for the girl. Okay, so then the next one is the Chinese gender predictor calendar. Um, so let's see what this one says. So it says, how old were you when you conceived? How about the morning? 21, and when did you conceive? I think we got our positive in May, right? Yeah. So April. It's a girl. All right, so another heart for the girl. Okay, so then the next one I have is body hair. If you're growing thick body hair, it's a boy. If it stayed relatively same, it's a girl. Um, my body hair, I've already started growing a lot of body hair like on my stomach, and I got a lot of body hair with her though too. But according to this, it says thick body hair means boy. So let's give a heart, heart to the boy. Good job. Perfect. All right, the next one is sleeping position. It says if you're sleeping on your left, it's a boy. If you're sleeping on your right, it's a girl. Um, I wake up facing the window, so I guess that's my left side. Yeah. My left side. Another one for the boy. Draw a heart. Beautiful. Okay, that's good, that's good. That's two. Okay, so the next one is sweet or salty. If you're craving sweets, that means a girl. If it's been salty, it's a boy. I can't really think. How many cravings have I had, Jake? Mm. What kind of cravings? What kind of cravings have I had? I was craving Smarties. Yeah. So I guess that's girl. So another one for the girl. Riley, sit down, please. Okay, sickness. I think the same goes if you've been, if you're not sick, it's a boy oh and a girl down. if you're sick. Sit. I have not been I sick, will. Sit so down. I guess that's one for the boy. And the next one is based off of your skin. It says if your skin's been clean and beautiful that it's a boy. And if you've been having problems, they say the girl steals your beauty. So um, I haven't had acne. Well, I've had a little bit of acne, which is unlike me, and I'm having a lot of dry skin. So I'm gonna say that's a girl. All right, so according to this, we have more for the girl than we have the boy. So I guess according to this, we're gonna have a girl. Um, in two weeks, we will actually find out the real sex of the baby. So if you wanna follow along, um, I should have a video up in two more weeks. We found out on the 21st, um, so 
then we'll know for sure. But we're excited. Are you excited, Riley? Yeah. Yeah? She really wants a baby sister, so. Hopefully we, maybe mommy can give you a baby sister. Maybe not, I don't know. According to this, you're having a baby sister though. Is that exciting? And mommy bye. Yeah, mommy's belly. All right, thank you so much for watching. Bye.